So we're going to start to think about engaging this core or this centre. Okay? So what I'd like you to imagine is, imagine you've got a belt really low down in your pelvis here. Okay? Your belly button, put your hand in it, your belly button is up here. Okay? The muscles we want to work are down here. So if you've been in a Pilates class and they've told you to pull your belly button into your spine, forget it. Okay? It was wrong years ago. Yeah? If you put your belly button into your spine, you're going to get muscles up here working to do that. These muscles, they don't attach to this spine and pelvis, this central block of control we need. Okay? Very low down, very low down. And imagine that belt's right down here. And it's got ten notches on that belt. Yeah? Now, don't do this. If you were to pull, pull, pull right into the tenth notch, you'd be working so hard that you couldn't move properly. So that doesn't make sense either, does it? Yeah, we're just standing here. We're not doing anything hard, so we shouldn't have to work hard. Yes? All right, hands here. We're going to pull in just to the first or second notch on that belt. A breath in and a breath out. Stop breathing and then slowly and gently think about drawing your lower tummy almost in towards your tailbone and just feel a gentle tension under these fingers. Yes? Now hold that and try and breathe normally without that tension changing. It just stays there. Good. Now by doing this, we're not doing one muscle, we're activating a series of muscles at the appropriate level for the task that we're doing. Yeah. Right, now keep that in, keep breathing, it should still be there. All right, and then relax. Okay, staying there. Let's think about a different way to think about this, your pelvic floor. Okay, so imagine uh, it was Sunday night last night, and as you sat down in the evening, you all thought, I've got a big important day to focus tomorrow, so I must drink water. And you drank a few glasses of water and then you were busting to go to the bathroom. But the bathroom's right up on the third or fourth floor of the hotel or wherever you're staying. So you can't work really hard, you've got to hold it until you get there. Okay? That sense of holding yourself before you go to the bathroom, yeah, not while you're in the bathroom, before you go to the bathroom, is your pelvic floor muscles. And they attach to all these centre muscles. So let's see if we can use those to wake up these abdominals. Hands in the same point. Little breath in. Little breath out all the way. Stop breathing. Slowly and gently think about drawing in and up through that pelvic floor, just gently holding yourself before you go to the bathroom. And you should feel that tension under your fingers again. Hold that and breathe normally. Okay, just breathe normally. Breathe normally. And then relax. Good, keep your hands there. So what we have here is different ways to activate the same group of muscles. One is thinking about our lower tummy muscles, another is thinking about our pelvic floor muscles. This is exactly how you're going to teach your clients as you progress on. 